What's up guys, I'm Bern. And I'm Romeo. Welcome to another edition of Poggy Boy Production Channel. We're gonna go eat some... Colombian food. I heard the Colombian hot dogs are good, right? Yeah, the hot dogs. And the burgers. There's a lot of good stuff here. Where are we? In Bergenland? We're in Bergenland. Bergenland, Jersey. New Jersey. All the Spanish chicas. <laughs> El Pareche. Parque. Is it Parque? Oh, El Parque. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna go inside. We're gonna go eat. And uh, let's go. Let's go. I had this in many What Colombia. Uh, I don't know. Orange? Orange. Is it good? I gotta try it. Maybe I'll try it. A lot of sugar though. It's good. Ew, they got special sauces. I wonder if one of them is definitely spicy. That's cool. Look at my rebounds. I think so. Yeah, this burger is good as hell. I'm gonna try this hot dog Romeo gave me. What do you think of the burger, bro? It's good. good? Wow, it's banging. Bang I recommend it. Recommend it. Do you around the area? What's this? Union City? Yeah. Burger line? El Parche. Let's try the hot dog. Several days later. Alright guys, believe it or not, I did go back a second time to El Parche because I wanted to try the hot dogs and I wanted to give you guys a closer look at what that hot dog looks like. So the waitress kind of messed up my order 
I thought I ordered the Pero Hueban, but this ended up being the Hawaiian-o. I thought I showed, I showed her a picture, but I guess she misunderstood. Anyway, it's all good. This hot dog was still pretty good. It comes with pineapple, ham, bacon, sausage, house salad, mozzarella cheese, crushed potato chips, quail eggs, and sauces. I know Romeo devoured his so fast, so I couldn't really get a good shot of it. But here it is. Look at that. It looks really, really delicious. So anyway, let's open up this hot dog, eat it, and I'll give you my first hand view, first hand report of what I think of it. So here it is, guys. Check it out. Look at that. Look at that. Work of art right there. They also gave you uh, some some of the sauces that we, we had over there. So don't ask me what they are about. But uh, <laughs> I'm sure one of them is spicy. But I'm going to go on ahead and uh, take a bite. Pour a little sauce in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. All right, I'm going to take my first bite. Mm. Mm. There's actual pineapple in here. So that gives it that the flavor you got the hot dog and you got the ham and I really can't tell you what else is in here but oh man this is really good combination of flavors is uh, excellent mm. oh the quail egg actually was here it fell off <laughs> I'm gonna eat it on the next bite but there you go you see the hot dog still there very small one more bite for you guys let me just take it <clears throat> Mm. Mm. That's so good guys. The chips also give it some nice crunch. So yeah. Thumbs up for me. I forgot what room you got. I think you got the El Parche hot dog. But this one has the um, the um, pineapples and the ham still have your quail legs they give you the special sauces I asked for some fries so I got some fries as well mm. worth it there's also different types of hot dogs they serve there so if this is not your thing I'm sure there are others there that you might like so yeah all right Romans, what do you think Oh, it was awesome, man. If you're in the area, definitely, definitely highly recommend it. You like the hot dog? Yeah, I love the hot dog, the burgers. Uh, it's actually better than Noches de Colombia. Yeah. And uh, the, price the price is, is cheaper. Yeah, very decent. If you like Colombian food, try it. It's like street food, like hot dog with burgers. Serv yeah. Service is great too. They speak Tagalog <laughs> and Spanish. <laughs> yeah, really uh, very hospitable food. So, yeah. If you're hungry, come to. Where is this? El Parache. El Parche. El Parche. <laughs> right. anyway. El Parche. What's El Parche again? Beef? Beef. Yeah, let's do that. Sorry for the abrupt end to that video. So, just want to also tell you that the Cholados, which was their dessert, which is like the Colombian, I would call it the Colombian Halo Halo. It was okay. I prefer Halo Halo. This one has very, was very fruity. Like, you can taste the strawberry taste to it. It's like, and there was a lot more fruits to it. I think it was plantains. I think there was a mango in there. I'm not sure. But there were so much different fruits in it. Definitely more fruity than uh, your your um, halo halo. Because it has ube and beans and you know all kinds of other ingredients. So if that's your thing. If you like a little bit of fruitiness. I would try the chulado. But if you're like me and you like the halo halo. You like a little bit of sweetness. And pick halo halo. <laughs> and like Romeo says. All the food was fantastic. I might come back try the hot dog. But uh, the one that he gave me was pretty good. And like, and the burger was good with all that cheese. It was melted on it. It was different. <laughs> so if you guys want to try it, it's in El Parche in Bergen Line, New Jersey. Which is about 
10 minutes from my place so depending on where you are it's close it's a very Spanish neighborhood so you can't miss it and uh, yeah give them a visit and order some good Colombian food so anyway guys if this is your first time here make sure you ring that bell button and subscribe down below uh, share this video so I can get plenty of eyes on this video like comment and share and we'll see you in the next one bye guys Thank you.